In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use a feature called expressions to add conditional logic to your forms. I'm going to click new form. I'm going to call this my connect card and then I'm going to click continue. And here you can see I've got uh, some fields on my form by default, uh, just some general things about uh, the person. And I'm going to click uh, the gender, I'll click delete, date of birth, delete, and we'll just have our email address and phone number there. And I'm going to click add field. I'm going to add a basic text field and I'm going to ask, do you have any children? And I'm going to change that to the data type to a true or false, which makes it a checkbox. And then I'm going to add another field and we're going to add person. Now uh, here I'm going to type in child for the title and you can see child as a person has first name, last name, gender, all that kind of stuff. Now we may want to get rid of the email uh, and phone number for the child uh, and just have first name, last name, date of birth, things like that. And what I want to do is click the child field and change the maximum answers to zero, which means that we can add as many children as we uh, could want. Uh, that just repeats that section of fields, as you can see, um, allowing the person to add multiple children. Now, what I'm going to do is add a few expressions. So I'm going to click the expressions field over here. So first off, I'm going to click last name and I'm going to add an expression to the last name field. And here I'm going to choose set default value to. I'm going to click the bullseye here and I'm going to click the contact last name, which is this field up here. And here we can start writing in. If I write John Smith, you'll see that the default value of the child fills in to whatever um, I write up here. And in addition to this, I only want this child field to appear if the person ticks, do you have any children? So I'm going to click the expressions for this field and I'm going to click uh, where it says show this field if. I'm going to click the bullseye and I'm going to click do you have any children? I'm going to click uh, that uh, option there. And now you'll see that that field only appears if I tick that button. And we can do all kinds of other things um, like joining people into specific groups, um, adding tags to them, adding them into follow-up processes, um, all kinds of different stuff. But that's the basics of how you can use expressions to show fields, hide fields, change the default value, make them required or not uh, based on the input of another field.